goodness. Okay, hey guys. <laughs> Mine's falling. I fell. <laughs> I felt there's a backrest. We went to two Goodwills yesterday here in Omaha area and found some pretty good stuff for Ryan. This is all stuff that he's selling. So if you see anything that you like or maybe that you want to buy, you can message me. Instagram is the easiest way. Or you can just comment on this video. Um, if you are new here, thank you for coming to my channel. This is Ryan, my son. He comes in every once in a while with some haul videos, usually, and sometimes thread up videos. But I'm a full-time reseller. Ryan sells, I don't know. I guess he doesn't do full-time hours. Maybe more like part-time while he's doing school and stuff. And yeah, I go by the Canary Closet and all my social media platforms. If you like reseller videos, I do three videos a week. So hit the subscribe button down below if that sounds interesting to you. And we're just going to get started. Okay, Ryan. I'm not sure if it's the biggest thing they have. Yeah, this is was a probably our most interesting find. <laughs> <laughs> Here it is. A so massive tiger that we found for like what, like four bucks? I think he was five. Four ninety nine. He came out on a new cart, but we actually didn't get him right away. But we looked at him like a little bit later. <laughs> <laughs> and he can sell for like fifty bucks, so it was definitely so it's Melissa and Doug is the brand, which is kind of like a good brand for like <laughs> the size of my head <laughs> for like uh, kids' toys and stuff like that. But we looked it up, and one just sold, I think, on December 9th for fifty dollars. So hopefully Ryan sells for the same amount. And you better be careful because Ellie might think that's a toy, and I wouldn't want her to like. Actually, I don't know what she would do because it's so big. I know. Huh? It would be funny to like put that up to her later. Ellie, are you down here? Ellie. Oh, I was gonna no. see what she would do if she She's comes not. back down. You have to get it out no. and see what she does. Okay. Let me uh, start with. Where do I put this mess? Oh my gosh, I don't know. We have so much stuff. I'm just gonna put it back where it was. Okay. Holy sheesh. Oh, some of this stuff is for my brother, but I'll just show you anyway if you're interested in like <laughs> men's stuff that sells good. <laughs> Our knees are hitting. So there's lots of Duluth trading. I'm just gonna show you this one. These are all like the 2X shirts that we found. So it's like short sleeve plaid um, shirt. And actually, these buttons are interesting because they, well, they look like buttons, but they're magnetic which is like kind of cool, I thought. So anyway, that's for him. I'll have to put that in a pile for Bubba. This is a new tags made well black, like top. Oh yeah. It's a black it's a size one X. Where'd I put my phone? I was gonna look There's that all up. all new stuff there. Where's my phone? Hey Siri. Sometimes you can find your phone like that. <laughs> Not usually. Oh, here it is. Okay. Show a couple other things and let me look that up and see what it's going for. It was plus size, which is also amazing. It was only $7.99. Okay, give this to me. Whoa, chill. Huh? Okay, you keep looking stuff up and let me see what this is. Looking I mean, you keep, showing you stuff? keep showing stuff while I look this up. Because we didn't look up at the thrift store. We just assumed Tord. that $8 was a good price for a new with tags made with. Tord size 5X super soft tank top. Or I guess this is kind of a short dress, but it has... Let me see. A mini dress? Yeah. Yeah, probably. It oh, it's a romper. Because it goes into shorts at the bottom. Oh, all right. So that's called a romper. Tie-dye. Pockets. That'll be good. <laughs> what? <laughs> That'll always be good. What? That makes sense. <laughs> That'll good. always be good? Yeah, because it's a good sizing. Well, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, where do I put the clothes? You're going to have to just make a new pile and then afterwards put them back in the bag. I'm not pulling this up. Okay, good then. Oh wait, I did. I put in the wrong style. Number. Oh my gosh. Take a while while my mom's Here it is. doing trash. Caldwell, Caldwell double breasted blazer. I'm gonna look that up while Ryan keeps showing things. Athleta long sleeve size small. It's kind of like a gray, but it has like the, like black and gray like cross line throughout it. It feels pretty soft, but I gotta check material. I think those are made with like modal, modal. sometimes. Yep, ninety percent, ninety-seven percent modal. <laughs> Because I've sold that exact thing before. Four bucks. Always good. Okay, so this exact one sold in a size large for 60, Ryan. 50, 55, 75, 90, 90. But since this is a 1X, I would say it would probably sell for more because none of those were plus size. So yeah. that was a good find. And Where are you putting your stuff? Right here? Yeah, plus it's new with tags, and I don't know if those ones were. I think some of them were. Here's a J. Jill new with tags. Kind of like an orange. This looks like a dress. Longer dress. Yeah. But. It's plus size J. Oh, Jill. It has button. buttons down here on the side. Let me see the material if it's anything special. Oh, 100% cotton. 
But it's kind of nice. It's like, feels like soft and it has pockets. Like a dusty coral orange. More Duluth trading. I guess I'll show these because maybe somebody would be interested in getting these for themselves or like their husband. 2X green shirt. And then we got a Can Can. This is, this is Can Can exclusively for Maurice's. Yeah, I just sold a plus size pair of those like really fast. Here they are. These ones are skinny jeans, but I feel like I still pick them up with like either really good brands or like some of the plus size brands like this because it still like went really fast. It has this like raw hem detail in the bottom and it's focusing on my face. What size are those in case anybody is interested? Size 24. Okay, uh, 24. Are, so that's a good size. Eating me on the skinny jeans then you picked them all up. Not, not all of them. Mm. Here we go again. Duluth trading. This one's like an orange and blue little like micro plaid shirt. I'm just not picking up a lot of skinny jeans. They have to have like some good qualities for me to get them. These are Hudson size 27, kind of more of a dark wash. Oh no. That's not supposed to be there. <laughs> um, I know I didn't pick these up, so. Whoops. Of course it's your fault. I was like, look at these, they're flare jeans. They, from the front, they look great. Sorry, Ryan. We'll just, that was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, my turn. Duluth no. Trading. This is a 2XL T, maybe? No, nope, this is just an extra large. Here's the colors. This one's a long sleeve button up, so it'll probably go a little bit more than the short sleeves. Taurus has 2X kind of black. Kind of looks like a military but style jacket has with those like, buttons. like a skirt at the bottom. Yeah, it's kind of like a ruffle. And a freaking handle in the back? Is that what it is? <laughs> is this called anything in the back? It's not called a handle, I'm sure looks like. Anyway, 2X. Ah. More Duluth trading, extra large. This one has some nice colors. It's kind of thicker, like a flannel material. Oh no, our battery's down to one bar. I hope it lasts. This is... My things are boring right now. It's all the men's stuff. <laughs> Torrid size 5X uh, jeans, but they have the drawstrings, right? Yep, drawstring yeah. and like a jogger style. So, I, because actually Torrid jeans don't do that good for me normally. I just sold them for $12 that I've had forever, and they were black skinny jeans. But I think those ones would be good because they're a pull-on style, jogger, and 5X. So it's a really good size. Here's a 2XL of Duluth Trading. This is a green plaid, short sleeve with the magnetic buttons again. And this is Torrid size 5X, like a pink All of these skirt. were like right next to each other. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's, well, it's like a skirt because there's shorts and underneath. stretchy. Yeah, and very it's stretchy. also wrinkled, so that's nice. Might have to put some water in the steamer and steam that. Make it look a little better. Yeah. Okay, this is for my brother still. Men's Tommy Bahama linen. And the size extra large tall with the blue like Hawaiian flowers. White short sleeve. And then we have some torrid size 5X kind of like... These are like... Oh, pajama pants maybe? I don't know. Or like casual like definitely? Loungy pants. They're like yeah. wide leg... But they're like cropped. Like. Very stretchy. Yeah. They, that would, if that so was like my size, I'd be like super comfortable. That's probably like lounge. And yeah, I would say lounge. Like that, but real stretchy. Nice. Okay, Duluth trading again, but now we're on to women. This is a size small dress. It's a short sleeve, like purple crew neck short sleeve dress. It's probably like a knee length. And this, sorry if I hit you, has a pocket on one side. Okay. Towards has size 5 towards super soft size 5 actually. Ooh, this, this is, is like um there's buttons. Is this the middle or is that the side? Uh, up here. Hard yeah, to tell the buttons you, are down hard the middle to tell front. Where you're at, huh? Super cool. Super cool design. I don't know what happened. Huh? Well, I do. Oh, here's another item for my brother, Foot Joy. He picks this up a lot. It's like a medium navy blue vest. This is kind of like a golf brand. So, good brand to look out for men. And then we got an oh, Ath praise, the furnace went off. Athleta <laughs> size large. Um, pink, long sleeve, kind of like Okay, fold it up jacket. so you can see what it looks like. I know, it's opening up the room. Right yes. Size large jacket. Stretchy, thumb holes. It's pockets. Pockets. Yep. That's cool. Oh, this is me. It's my white hoodie. I've been looking for a plain white hoodie and a plain black hoodie. You wouldn't believe like that hoodie is how you. hard that is to find. For my new style, Ryan. You're like, this hoodie is me. No, I meant Turned it's mine. <laughs> I meant it's mine. Oh, the one teaspoon. Oh. Shorts. Shorts, yep. 
Those ones. Warts. We'll see if they're as good as the last ones. The last ones were really unique, so they probably won't Either be Either way, as they're good. size 27. Ryan sold some before that had like this cotton? black fringe tassels coming off of them Sounds for a like, lot of money. Like 76 bucks. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is just Joe's jeans, which I don't pick up a lot because there's a lot of really old styles. So I had Ryan specifically look up these certain styles, which he hated, but I told him it's part of the job. She was like, look these up, look these up, look these up. <laughs> well, I was stuff. looking and I'm like, well, you can look them up. Teamwork. Anyway, it was the Lara, which is a mid-rise cigarette ankle, and they are a size 29, but comps looked pretty good for these. They're I good. feel like these ones that have like the exact style name right here are newer the older ones just have like a style number so i think that's why and they're like a medium wash no distressing or anything but um yeah that'll be good these are american eagle distress size four mom destroyed jeans. i would say or destroyed because yeah. look at them i can see through them from the back and on the back yeah they're distressed in the front and the back so like I'm extra bear clawed right now extra <laughs> destroyed either way I, somebody it's probably a mom wants jeans, so that's good yeah good style Okay, these are a kid size three Chaco sandals. So I pretty much always pick up Chacos when I see them. I don't know the exact style of these, so if you do, like, let us know for when Ryan's listing them. But those will be super easy to list. Ryan, the size is right back here. It says three. So on Chacos, it's back oh, that's there. Funky. So yeah, pretty good condition. Maybe twenty, twenty-five dollars. Here are size twenty-eight Ariat jeans. Yep. And I looked up and I found these exact ones and they were selling around like $70. So that's Yeah, much. he found some for $70. I don't know if they all sell for that much. But the ones with the stars inside, that's the one that I saw and that one yeah. was that much. It was, I just told him to make sure before he lists them to look up the style number um, just to be sure. Because I don't like to price it at the very highest sold comp. I try to put it like in the middle. Unless I'm really trying to sell it fast, then I put it more towards the bottom. Which is what I've been trying to do on Poshmark lately. Um, Athleta size 6 tall. These are a pair of like gray, just classic mid-rise, like outdoor kind of pants. Um, tall and long are always good. There's a zipper down here for some reason. Okay, I guess. I don't know if you're like hiking and stuff. Down here. Like by your knee. Oh, yeah. That's kind of normal. Maybe for hiking. Anyway, those are nice. This is new with tag Zaya Active size 3XL. Pants. Yep. So Here's the name right really here, which good. would be really easy, Ryan. Black, don't wake me, thermal joggers. Yeah, well, <laughs> you missed his face. 15 bucks. Well, oh, they were store. half off, remember? Because oh, yeah, they were green they tag. Were half off. And then. So, they're they're also so, new so 7 50 And a really good size. Yeah. So that will sell very well. Yeah, that should be good. Uh, Ryan got these shorts, which actually not many people are shopping for shorts right now because it's out of season. So it's a good time if you have time at the thrift store to look for them. They're the high rise shorty in a size 12 white distressed denim shorts you might be able to find some good stuff because most people are looking at like boots jeans sweaters coats stuff like that this is probably our best item oh this is a I new so. tags free people it was like a sequin flower i don't remember what it was exactly was maybe called. like a kimono or jacket sequin, sequin flower here, hold it up. and it was priced at 50 bucks because it was on their supposed good rack yeah. And, uh, I mean, it is. Cute. It has side slits on the side with this bandana print on the inside. And then we looked up the comps and some had sold for over 200 bucks. so. The retail is $298. Um, the lowest sold comp, I think, was around 100 but we saw some yeah. over 200 Yeah. So Easy. I told Ryan maybe to just start it high. So that's probably pretty good. See what happens. So that's exciting. Uh, this is a pair of Linen Blend J. Crew pants. They're a size 10 factory um, maybe like an ankle style with pockets, um, cuffed at the bottom. This came out in a new rack. We don't really sell much vintage, but I felt like this was cool. It's the Denver Broncos. It's like a vintage pullover gray men's sweater with the helmet. Um, it's a size extra large. I don't know if Fruit of the Loom, that means anything with vintage tags. Anyway, I don't know. I thought it was cool. And it's kind of like football season, right? <laughs> I'm not a football person, but... I know it is. Season in the winter. I know it is. So yes, smart. because Dad's watching football. Okay, I'll start putting this stuff back, and you can get the next couple bags. So give one to me. This is a pair of Levi's wedgie jeans. They're a size 26, and I think when you see this, like Levi's premium, whatever it says, um, and like this kind of tag, they're like better quality. 
is what I've heard. So I'm kind of steering away from like the 721 skinny or the 711 skinny. But I think these wedgie ones will do good. They feel like really good quality. They're button fly, medium wash. Okay. This is a half and size 2X. Is this leather? No, it can't be. But it's really like soft and it kind of looks <laughs> leatherish. But it's pretty nice. Usually the Catherine's material is right up with their size tag, Ryan. Oh, yeah. No. 100% polyester. It just, it's, it's kind of a nice look. Whoops. It's kind of a nice look here. <laughs> kind of a nice look. Anyway, nothing else to say about that. It reminds me of an animal. Okay. Just black jeans, size 31. We got these because they are a boyfriend fit, not a skinny. And they're a better size. So I thought they'd be good. And they have the raw hem. I sold a pair of just black, like, flare jeans for, I think, 28 recently. Okay. Here's some green and gray, <laughs> not too dirty, Vionic um, shoes. These are tennis shoes. Yep. Are they for what size? Women? Yeah, they're for women. That's kind of like a That's comfort. running. Oh, no. They're probably, like, for, like, comfort or, like, walking. They are size USA 8. 8. Size 8. Okay. Um, American Eagle, again... These are the high-rise jegging in a size 16, white distressed. So Ryan said he just wanted to try these. He said he does good selling white jeans. So we got those. Here's some Kids Galaxy Vans, but they're slip-ons, but they're still really clean. Like, you can see there's no stains or anything yeah. on the felt part. There's a little bit of, like, random... You could, like, use a little bit of rubbing alcohol or part. magic eraser on that white part. Grass and dirt on that, but... What size? Um, four? They are size... Where did you get four from? Because I think I remember that from they yesterday. Are four. Okay. I remember. Okay, this is a pair of cabbie jeans. These are yellow, and they are skinny jeans, size four. Uh, Ryan sells colored jeans somehow, and I don't. I You're First of all, like I don't like to sell them. I don't know. I just don't like them. But, and then I just can't. Like, they don't sell good for me. But they do for Ryan, so he went ahead and got Cabbie jeans are great, and plus they're colored... Best ones are the brick dust. Look out for some red cabbie jeans. <laughs> Those are the best to sell. These are Sam Edelman. What do you even say? Like shiny flowered heel metallic boots? floral boots. Um, I think they're a size six and a half, if I remember correctly. They are. Can't see the lighting. I think they're six and a half. Okay. Well, Ryan's looking. Yeah, I'm going to show the next thing. Oh no, our battery's getting low. See if it makes it. Hudson. Size 27, again, some colored jeans, but Ryan looked them up. They're the Nico Super Skinny, and he said they still sold pretty well, so Two we went ahead jeans. and got them. She's like, I would never sell those. Looked them well, up. I would Mostly over 35. You're okay, right. well, I don't know. I just... No, I know you don't. I just, just normally wouldn't. Not very many resellers These pick up colored jeans. Torrid platforms these things are like pretty yeah big. platform sneakers that's the size of my head black what size uh black size, this thing size is if it runs oh. out we're just going to finish the video on our phone because i don't want to wait for this to charge again 11 i think okay size 11 11 they're 11. in really nice condition so yeah that has an item number just like the torrid clothing so oh, you can nice. look it up and see what they're selling for and they're they don't really have that much wear at all on the bottom just a little dust they're so, pretty good that's a good find. new with tags torrid size 2x this is like a black mesh back with like the grommets on the sleeve open cardigan sweater uh, actually it zips up in the front i thought it was open so that's good new attacks towards always good catherine size 2x it's kind of like a purple white and blue like i don't even know how you describe this i would just say pattern top like or printed like a, it's long sleeve long sleeve um yep. two chest colored. pockets i don't know Button catherine's top. Still does good for me. Always I just sold good. a 4X nightgown for like $27 in like a day. Uh, this pair of Eileen Fisher 1X pants. These are black. And <laughs> I don't know what else I was going to say there. <laughs> Organic cotton blend. And they're like a pull-on style, but they almost look like an active style with the gray striped on the side. Okay, fun which fun. I've never really seen of like active style. They're almost more like leggings. So we'll see how those do. These are some torrid size 2X, kind of like stretchy, maybe like oh, pants. Somebody was asking me, what size are those torrid pants that you showed? And I feel like we showed a ton. Let me take a picture and ask her if that's the one she wanted. Her name's Bonnie on Instagram. Oh, Scoot it back a little bit. <coughs> She's bought things from Either me before. Way. And I thought they were 5X ones. 
There's Kay. two X. I'm gonna have to send her that picture because that might be what she wanted. Ryan got this for himself. It's not a Squishmallow. It's just a baby. You Still. Have. Okay, we're gonna finish uploading this in her phone because I don't feel like going upstairs to charge my battery for an hour and then do it. So if the quality is a little worse, sorry. We're just trying to get this finished. Either way, this can go into my collection as a very good one. Looks like an egg, but nice and soft. Mm-hmm. Baby Yoda. Okay, we have an Athleta dress. This is a size large petite. It's like a red sleeveless with a tie in the middle. I thought it was a jumpsuit at first, but it's actually a maxi dress, which I like better because, oh, it has this big slit down the side too. Jumpsuits don't do that good for me. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have a dry throat. Go get me some water up there. One that you spoke, like half of them? Yeah. Okay, this is Zaya Active. Is that 3XS? Yeah, I think it's 3XL. 3XL. A great size. Blue, kind of like clear striped tank top, I guess. Mm-hmm. You want to put see-through, maybe mesh. Yeah. Tank top. 3XL is a great size. This is a J. Crew factory dress size, extra small. It's a maxi dress. It's red sleeveless with kind of like this tiered look all the way down. So that's really pretty. It might not sell right away, but I think like come January, people already start to be thinking about summer and spring items. Like stores will be putting out swimsuits. So you might as well start buying that kind of stuff. This is Bowden size 12, but the tag is on the side of the neck. But oh, either way, yeah. it's like a kind of like a pink, red, pink. I feel like this would be good for Valentine's Day. It looks like a strawberry. Well, <laughs> strawberries are red. True, but pink. Okay, so a Bowden top. Here we have universal standard dress. size small dress made in Peru. I think it's a dress. It's like a V-neck mini dress. It's very soft, pink. It has actually a slit on the side here. So is it a swimsuit cover up or a dress? It's only a slit on one side though. Hmm, I don't know. Anyway, it's really cute and it's very soft. Oh, here's the material tag. I wanted to see what it was. It's Pima Cotton Blend, so that's probably why. And it looks like, Ryan, there's a style number, so you can use that to look it up. Okay. Yeah. Jay Jill, size 3X, flower, kind of like a... Tunic top? Not a really long sleeve, but it's kind of short sleeve. Maybe like three-four sleeve. Three-four yep. sleeve, stretchy tunic top. Okay. Next, I feel like this is cashmere. It's Free People, size large. It's a gray sweater. Here's what it looks like in the front. It kind of like has this like crossover detail. What? Maybe it like wraps around when you wear it. Rib sleeves. Let me see the material. Sorry. It's a nylon wool alpaca spandex blend. So Ryan, you want to use all of those keywords, especially the wool and alpaca. It's kind of like a mock neck when you list this. This is another J. Show top. Another size 3X top as well. It is a kind of like a little micro floral. They're really tiny. That weird. Anyway, it's a long sleeve. <gasps> what? How are you holding this? Here's the I don't sleeve. Know, it's weird. It is a little Get like the tag in the middle. It is. No, it's not. Well, there. It's still look. Like this a, is the keyhole. It's in the front. <laughs> Give me this hey, thing. Hey, no, rip it. Look. It's not any better. It's just still a square. Yes. No, look. It's not. The keyhole's in the front middle. Here's how it goes. See? That's all I have it. Okay. This is my last. <laughs> this is my last thing. More Hudson color jeans. Ryan looked them up again. Said Rose they were fine. They were a size 30. They're a red, like high rise skinny jeans. Those ones are selling for 30, but the other ones are actually selling better. So okay. they were a little bit newer. Okay. So that's it, guys. That is our haul. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back on Friday for my What Sold video. My sales actually so far this week have been like pretty good. They were good this weekend, and then they were good yesterday on Monday. I made 13 sales. But. What is weird is, Grace is, oh, she's texting me a picture of the crock pot. Is this supposed to be on? Yes, it is. I'm down. I'll have to go turn that on. Um, what's weird is last night, our mail carrier, it was like 7.38 and we're like, our packages are still out there. I'm like, I guess they're not coming. So we bring them in. Then we like get a doorbell at like nine o'clock and it was the mailman with his like headlamp on. I'm like, holy crap. So luckily he still came, but I'm like, I've never had somebody come pick up my packages that late. My sales were kind of trash for a while during the Christmas shopping, but then randomly I kind of popped off and made four sales. Yeah. Two sales on each day, which usually I'm like, don't make a ton more than like two. So. You try to get two a day, don't you? Yeah. Is that your goal? Kind of however many you list. Oh, so I got to double that. 
I, I did end up getting Ryan like a basic store on eBay so he could run a sale. So we're running a we're running a twenty percent off sale, I think, right now in his store. So we'll see if that helps. Okay, we're gonna be done talking. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys again soon. Again, comment, like, subscribe. That's it. Bye.